what's going on guys so today i'm going to show you guys how to deploy safemoon fork in less than five minutes so without further ado let's get started here's remix if you're not familiar with remix essentially it's probably the easiest tool to deploy smart contracts and it works with any block uh, any blockchain so i know it says ethereum but you can use it with polygon you can use it with binance today we're using it with the binance smart chain testnet so let's get started so here we have safemoon their bsc scan which through here you're able to find their whole contract code so if you click contract go to contract here you will see the verified source code for safemoon so you're going to want to copy that so now we're in a new we're in a new workspace brand new so it has all these contracts you can pretty much just ignore those for right now so we're just going to create a new file in the contracts folder make sure we're in the contracts folder create a file we're going to name it sfm fork dot soul. So, and then we're going to go ahead and paste the text. And from there, we're going to want to scroll up to right around line 700. And this is all the stuff that you're going to want to be editing. So, see where it says safe moon fork. And you get to safe moon fork. work we're just starting by changing all the names and obviously you would change this into whatever you want the name of your token to be and so here you can adjust the fees so the tax fee would be whatever gets recirculated to the holders so i'm gonna leave that at five for my token and then liquidity fee i'm also gonna leave that at five because you want money being added to the liquidity pool constantly okay so we're leaving this all the same being that it represents the um, the transactions and the decimals. So right now there's a billion tokens in supply. I'm going to leave a billion in my fork, but you can change this to whatever you want the total supply to be over here. So this, you can leave all this the same. So also leave the decimals the same. And so for the last thing before we deploy the token, this right here is the pancake swap router, which this is the V1 router. So you're not going to want to use that at all. Don't. Even if you're going to stay on the mainnet on Binance, you're going to want to use the pancake swap V2 router. Otherwise, your contract can freeze and you don't want that happening. So here we have testnet version of pancake swap. And this is their router. So I'm going to copy the address. I'm going to paste it in there and our code is all ready to go. So we're going to go here. We're going to make sure everything was compiled correctly. Here's everything looks good. So now we're going to go to here, deploy. So now, get rid of that so it's not confusing. So now we're going to go with Injected Web 3. And right now we're on the Binance Smart Chain Testnet. My wallet, as you can see, I have some BNB in there. If you don't have BNB, I'll show you guys how to get BNB, or I'll put the wallet link in the description below. So we can just leave this the same with the zero way. Make sure when you deploy the contract, you're going to want to deploy safe moon fork. That's the constructor. So just click deploy. I'm going to tell you the gas fees. Just hit confirm. So it's going to take a second. Published IPFS. Paste. We're going to paste the address in the BSD scan on the testnet. Wrong address. Sorry. Copy that. Paste it. And you'll see. Safe move fork. That's the token I created. So yeah, that's how you deploy a smart contract in less than five minutes. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, make sure you like the video and you subscribe. I'll be uploading more blockchain videos in the near future. Thanks for following. Peace out.